Hello friends, welcome to the Nestle tutorial. Today I am going to show how to install Go Access on CentOS 7. Go Access is a real-time web log analyzer. Now I am going to show how to install it. First we need to install development tools for Mac and GCC. Now it's ask confirmation, you just give I and then press enter to start the installation process. Ok now development tools installation process is completed. Then next you install some dependencies library files. Type m install commands like this after that press enter. Now it's ask confirmation you just give I and then press enter to start the installation process. Dependency library files installation process is completed. Now you download Go Access. First you move OPT directory. Use wget command. Ok now download process is completed. Next you extract the tar file using tar command. Type the command like this after that press enter. Next you enter the extracted go access directory. Next run the configure command for prepare the installation. Ok now configure process is completed then next you run make and then make install. Then next run make install. Ok that's it now installation process is completed. Then next you install httpd. Just type m install httpd. Type the command like this after that press enter. Now it's ask confirmation you just give y and then press enter to start the installation process. Ok that's it now Apache installation process is completed. Ok next start HTTPD service by using systemctl command. Type the command like this after that press enter. Ok now create analyzed HTML file for Apache access log. You just use go access command you just type the command like this after that press enter next open your browser and type your IP address with report.html file you just type your IP address then report.html Ok that's it now you can able to see go access dashboard. Here you can able to see bandwidth and log size, failed request and total request. That's it friends. I hope in this video can help you understand how to install go access on CentOS 7. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe our channel and more videos visit www.linuxhelp.com for any queries. Mail to support at